Now you should follow suit and just get to the bay. People gon' talk either good or it's bad. Let's see, people gon' talk either good or it's bad. Hey everybody, welcome back to the Empress Kina Show. As you can see from the title, we are going to talk about DoorDash versus Uber Eats. If you are interested in working for DoorDash as a driver or working for Uber Eats as a driver, I will give you the pros and cons about each one, what I prefer over the other and why. Uh, first of all, DoorDash is a scam. Period. It's a scam. If you actually look at the way they break down the pay for each order, they pay you a base pay of like one to two dollars, like one to two dollars. And recently they actually started to like upgrade it in certain areas. So they're working on getting it better. They literally had a scam going on a couple months ago where they were having to pay people back because they were taking people's tips. The base pay, like I said, is very low. I could do an order and I'll pick it up from the store. Then I'll have to drive it, whether it's five minutes from the restaurant or 15 minutes from the restaurant and I made like six dollars six dollars bro and I just drove 12 miles like 15 miles it's literally half the pay rate of uber eats so when you look at uber eats for one order you make it like six or seven dollars depending on the distance they actually calculate the time that it takes you to pick up the order and the time it takes you to drop it off the mileage so how many miles you have to go they calculate all of those things into how much they're paying you for example one time i was delivering an order and i live in chicago i went downtown i didn't know it was like a parade going on i had no clue so i was downtown stuck in water wall traffic for like an hour i had picked up an order i literally had to cancel the order and i felt really bad but i had been trying to get to that person for over an hour and the street that they lived off of was blocked off so it was literally no way I could even get there I got paid even though I didn't even drop the order off I got paid $20 for that one order just because it had took me so long plus I got to keep the food get to keep the food if either the person cancels it or you have to cancel it be careful with that because people be canceling stuff not taking people their food and that's to me that's just wrong why would you pick up somebody's food and not drop it off why would you bring it to somebody else's club that's safe but anyway Let's get into the pros and the cons of each one. So for DoorDash, I'll start off with the pros and then I'll go into the cons. Whenever I work with DoorDash, it always gives me an order a lot quicker than Uber Eats. Whereas with Uber Eats, it sometimes takes me like 20 minutes to get an order. Um, they also have more details in their app in DoorDash. You log into DoorDash, you can go to specific areas and they tell you where it's popping. This is where a lot of orders are. This is where a lot of restaurants are. It'll literally guide you and tell you where you need to go yeah that's pretty much all the pros about doordash so the cons they pay significantly less money the way you work with doordash you log into a specific shift and it blocks off a certain amount of time that you're guaranteed to get orders so you log into that shift and log into an area say i want to go to bluesville i'm just making up an area from seven to nine i'll go into the app i'll click on bluesville and i'll click seven to nine because that's when i want to go out if i'm in bluesville and i pick up an order but then i have to take the order to greensville once I'm in Greensville, I'm not going to get any orders because I'm scheduled in the app to be in Bluesville. So now I have to drive all the way back to Bluesville in order for me to keep picking up orders. Whereas with Uber Eats, if you start in Bluesville and then you end up in Greensville, they'll start giving you orders and once you're in Greensville because it can track your location. Also, so you have to work for two weeks or make 60 trips. You don't, you know, meet that criteria or whatever. You just have to wait until the end of every week for you to get paid. Okay, on to Uber Eats. I love Uber Eats. Sponsor me. Okay, no, but for real, I love Uber Eats because one, there's just a bigger market and I think that's why they pay more personally. That's what I'm assuming. It just pays you more. So I got paid $15 for doing two orders for DoorDash, but I ended up getting paid $25 for doing two orders for Uber Eats. And I'm actually gonna do a video after this showing you just how much money you can actually make in Uber Eats in one week. So stay tuned for that. It doesn't make you do too much. Like with DoorDash, you pick up the order and then you gotta check off all of these things. Like, did you check the bag? Did you make sure the order is correct? I don't know, like they make you check all of these things off before you can even swipe to say start delivery. Whereas Uber Eats, it's two step. Click, I accept the order. Click, I'm at the restaurant. Click, I'm picking up the order. Click, I drop the order off. With DoorDash, all right, before you you start DoorDash, make sure you have your this and your that and your this. And then, okay, now you can go online. All right, do you have everything that's in the bag? Hey, check it out. Okay, now you're ready to go. Like, y'all doing too much. Like, y'all making me do too much. I just want to click, click, click so I can go. You feel me? I'm a very impatient person. A lot of people aren't trying to click all these buttons. It's 2020. 
We got face recognition. We don't even got to type buttons in to open our phone. And y'all trying to make us okay, so enough for DoorDash. Another thing that I like about Uber Eats, you can cash out five times a day. But with DoorDash, how I mentioned earlier, it takes you two weeks for you to get instant pay. Before that, you have to use their direct deposit system, which is once a week. Instant pay means you can cash out daily. But even when you get to the point where you qualify for instant pay, you only can get that once a day. Whereas with Uber Eats, you can get instant pay automatically and you can do it five times a day. The only thing that I will say that is a con for Uber Eats is that it's just slower. Sometimes it be taking me a minute before I get an order. Whereas with DoorDash, I don't care what location I go to, where I'm at in the city, I'm gonna always get an order like as soon as I go online, like two to three minutes later. And then I also don't like the fact that the Uber Eats app is a little less detailed. With Uber Eats, it'll show you the busy areas, but that's it. It just shows you an area that's busy. It doesn't show you specific locations that you should go to. You just kinda gotta know where to go. Whereas with DoorDash, you can go to an area and it'll show you specifically where to go in that area. If I'm in this area, here with Uber Eats, it'll just say this area is popping. So now you in this popping area, but you in the middle of nowhere. You don't know where the restaurants are. You don't really know where to go. You kind of got to figure it out if you don't know. Whereas with DoorDash, you go to an area and it's telling you, boom, right there in the little corner over here. That's where all the restaurants is. Go there. But other than that, I typically prefer Uber Eats over DoorDash. Now, I'm going to put y'all on game. I'll be using Uber Eats, but I'll log into DoorDash and then it'll literally tell me what areas to go to and obviously they are restaurants so it's not just like these are only DoorDash's restaurants and these are only Uber Eats restaurants. So that's a little finesse trick. So I guess I'll just wrap up the video. There are pros and cons to both of them but I personally prefer Uber Eats because it pays more at the bottom line. That's really my main thing but I still do use DoorDash every now and then so. Alright well stay tuned for my next video and I will show you guys how you can make a thousand dollars a week with Uber Eats.